balance the chemical equation. Let's take a look at this equation representing the chemical reaction. In this equation, the reactants are octane and oxygen, and the products is carbon dioxide and water. If we look at this equation, we can see that the equation is not balanced. In the reactants side, there are eight carbon atoms, eighteen hydrogen atoms, and two oxygen atoms. And the products side, there are one carbon atom, two hydrogen atoms, and three oxygen atoms. The number of atoms is not balanced on both sides. To balance the chemical equation, we need to make use of coefficients. A coefficient is a number that we place in front of a chemical formula. In this equation, we need to balance the carbon atoms first. To do this, we need to put a coefficient of eight in front of CO2. The carbon atoms are balanced. Now you can balance the hydrogen atoms. To do this, we need to use another coefficient of nine in front of H two O. Now the number of carbon atoms and the number of hydrogen atoms are balanced on both sides, but the number of oxygen atoms are not balanced. To balance the oxygen atoms, we need to use of another coefficient. This time, we need to use a coefficient of twenty five by two in front of O two. Now you can multiply the equation by a coefficient of two on both sides. The equation is now balanced. There are sixteen carbon atoms, thirty-six hydrogen atoms, and fifty oxygen atoms on both sides. If you like this video please subscribe my channel and press on the bell icon